Oh, they make it even obvious. It's funny. You know, it's good that they make it somewhat obvious because it is part of progressing the story, after all. I don't want to make it too obtuse. Leave the obtuse stuff for whenever you need to. Uh, this prime plants aren't here again. Are they are? I uh, leave the two stuff for just like secrets. That way it feels more rewarding. <laughs> Do I need to go to the dock or can I just go? the pipe. I'm gonna try going through the pipe. Hopefully it doesn't make me waste time though. Oh. Oh, he actually tells you. Okay. I guess because they need to set these flags for the story. You can skip that. I wonder if I'll be able to catch up to them. Oh no, they're going way too fast. Um, do I have stuff I can cook? I have the mangoes, but I got all this other junk. Maybe I'll do the cooking next chapter. Because I'll be getting more stuff next chapter to cook with. I think I'll do a bunch of that then. Smiles out. <laughs> hey, wake up! <laughs> I should have tried hammering him when I was on top of him. I think, uh, whenever you want to see Don Pianta again, I think he's in the Pianta parlor. He's just, like, sitting in the corner.
<laughs> nah, I'm good. I don't want to be a whacking people. I mean, I'm technically killing a bunch of people already, but like, not for you guys. Oh, I should have had a Vivian out for this. Um, let me go level up some partners first. I said I was going to do Kumbella and Coops. It'd be kind of good to do uh, Vivian. But I think that's fine. If I had nine, I would, but... Gonna be Coops and Goombella. Or should I do Prince Mush first? Oh. Yeah, let's do Prince Mush and then we'll start the chapter. Is, uh, whoops. Keep the damage dodge. Um, there's a spike shield. We don't need that. The other damage dodge on. Uh, I don't think we need to worry about flower saver here. Okay, I think that's fine. I don't think a simplifier helps with super guarding. At least I don't remember. It does, that's pretty good. I think what I'll do Use Spite Pouch on Mario and have Bobbery have counterattack. Just to see if counterattacks are things that stop Prince Mush besides Super Guards. And then if if we fail the fight, we fail the fight, and we'll just start chapter uh, six. Make sure I heal up first, though. Mashing start. Oh, I forgot to have Bobbery out. Ok, 
Okay, let me put the spike pouch on Mario and just have Lyle Bert swap himself out. Oh, he blocks it. Okay. Ah, uh, they really thought of everything there. If that's the case. I guess I'll just power lift. Ah, oh, dang it. Oh wow, that was pretty bad. I only got two four. So does this cheater just not take damage from these two? No, not this again. So I forget, do I need to jump on it in this form? There we go. Well, that's perfect because the bombs are gonna go off. This music is really good. Now, oh, so close to four four. I still want to be dodges. I think you have to use a hammer. Oh, there's a stylish. Okay. Let's see. Is he going to dodge these? Dude, that's so lame that they just make him immune to a bunch of stuff. Might as well just appeal, I guess. attacking him. It doesn't really do much. There we go. be good at those super guard timings. Okay, well let's uh start chapter six then.
Hopefully this chapter is, isn't too bad. Like I said, this chapter isn't the greatest on replays, but on the first try, going on it and the first time, it's a pretty good uh, chapter. Actually, probably would have been better to talk, just go down the blimp because it takes you right next to the uh, train. Oh well. I've already committed. I gotta be using these items too. I just got tons of them I'm not really using. I need this space once I start cooking after this chapter. I don't think I'm gonna be playing for that long. Actually, we should have a uh, flurry out. She feels like the kind of character who would be on this train. I guess Flurry doesn't have to really watch her step because she doesn't have feet. There's a shine sprite in our room. Oh, that. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, <laughs> well, that sucks. I've always wanted to ride a train, but I've never done it before. They're not a really common thing in America. I mean, we do have them, but I don't hear great things about them. I would like to take one irregardless of that. Reading her text gives me a little motion sickness. Wait, if Cheap Cheap is his first language, then what language is he speaking right now? Talk to this guy in the back about the threat we got. I think the penguin guy is gone. He must be in the other part with everyone else talking about the first mystery of the train. Always gotta be mystery on a train. Otherwise, what's the point? It's 
text. I'll put the wavy text. That's funny of a mouse guy saying rats. It's like if we said, oh, humans. Yeah, there's a slight difference between mouse and rats, but still. <laughs> I'm interested to see the small touches they add to this chapter. <laughs> I like that little pose. <laughs> the gluttonous woman. That's a that's a great insult to hurl at somebody. Also, her text isn't waving anymore. It's shaking, but it's not waving. <laughs> okay, she's pissed now. Back to waving again. Tweety. That's a good insult. Hopefully this doesn't lead to a, a joke about fat people. Oh no, it does. Does this guy have a name, by the way? I don't know if he does. Hefty. Ah, uh, come on. <laughs> oh my goodness. How does he fit a whole pot in here? That is one, like... Dimension warp and drawer there. Although there's other foods for everyone else in the car, because like I'd be pissed if I paid for dinner and then some dude just goes and eats everything. I'd be pissed at the dude. We can demand a refund or something, but like, I mean, if all the food's gone, that's just gotta be upsetting. Think of others first before you eat all the food, man. Oh, I thought she was going to ask me about... She does ask you to find something for her. I guess that's later on. And you know, speaking... Oh, that's cool. That <laughs> it shows it popping back. There is a star panel in here, isn't there? I think of something else. 
Oh, you know what I am? I think it's in one of the rooms. I forget which room it is. Doubt it's our room because they already put a shine sprite in there. It's this one. I think you get two other shine sprites on board, but there's one in the front of the train. You get one from one of the bomb kids. There's just one bomb kid. <laughs> yeah. It got darker. Oh, never mind. I thought it got darker. What do I do to progress the story again? Did I talk to the conductor? Do I talk to him? Oh, I guess I talked to him. I guess he might have said earlier to meet him in his room. You can call me Luigi. I love Luigi. Luigi's voice echoing there. That's great. So I wonder if Luigi on his travels for the Seven Compasses met up with Pennington. That'd be kind of interesting. Oh, now it transitions. <laughs> Look how tired he is. <laughs> I had to go all the way around because of where I was positioned. I'm still the champion. Well, except against Prince Mush, I can't beat that guy. Not yet, at least. I think we talked to him. So I think we need to go to the front, which is good, because there is a star piece over there I need to get. Talk to the... Driver of the train? What is the specific? Train conductor? No, because the other guy was the train conductor. Mm. The song is good, though. It was good in the original, too. Just very soothing. This one feels like it's a little bit more subdued, though. A train engineer, I guess. See, this one I always forget. You need to talk to somebody else. Do I need to talk to the kid? Back and forth is a little annoying. I always forget what you need to do.
Can I talk to her now about that thing she's looking for? There we go, yeah. I have to talk to somebody else too because they're missing something. I think Toodles is on here too. We need to talk to her about... I think she's missing a necklace. a ring not a necklace oh you know I gotta confuse a flurry <laughs> when you need to get her necklace from her okay, hopefully he does the autograph now I don't remember who else I need to talk to there we go I like how the in the background you can see the little like cloud lines or whatever those called that kind of reminds me of a Yoshi's Island a bit. Or maybe it's supposed to represent like the wind or something? I don't know. Go give this kid his present. He gives us a shine spark for this. I would wonder where he's getting these things from, but I mean, there was one in our cart or in our room, so really not going to question it too much. Not because things are super hard to get. Doesn't PI usually have uh, periods in it to help denote that they're like abbreviations for personal investigator? Because my username is Cardboard Pi, but it's like meant to reference the uh, mathematical number of Pi, not actual food Pi. Although, it is kind of weird because I do have um, my icon is a Pi, because it's just a joke on. You know, food pie, math pie. Why are you guys afraid of ghosts? You guys have seen booze already. I like the music for this. It's very spooky. I don't help ghosts. <laughs> I like the scary toad voice. That's pretty cool. I like that that pose. Yeah, if you read it, uh, it's a game over, so don't do it.
Was it always in the chest or was it just lying there? Kind of weird that it's just in a chest. If I'm being completely honest. I mean, it is weird that it's also lying on the ground, but I feel like there should have been like a drawer or something that you find it in. Yeah, I'm not dying over your curiosity. Oh, that's cool. They have the little lay motif in there, too. That's cute. Here's a journal, dude. Oh, diary. Is there a difference between a journal and a diary? Place it in the drawer? Oh, okay. See ya. <laughs> I love this music. Let me see your stuff. I can't hit him, can I? I guess that makes sense. You can't hit a ghost. Flurry do anything? Yeah, okay. I think what I'm gonna do is I'll give the conductor his blanket, and then I'm just gonna cut the cording here, because I gotta go get some food. I'm hungry. Probably come back later in the day and finish recording this chapter. I don't want this. I like how he reminds me what cabin I'm in. I know, I know where my room is. I guess for new people they might forget. Oh, this must be a nice time to be out on this train. Just seeing all the stars. It being a little chilly. That sounds nice. Okay, I'll see you guys in a bit. 